Come on, Gunther is top tier here, bro. Uh, heel, bro. Let me see. They booing the hell out. <laughs> it's the undeniable. That man is one of the greats, bro. I know. <laughs> he getting booed like shit. Oh my goodness. Let me explain myself real quick. They don't want to hear from you, bro. We don't want to hear Everybody had enough, bro. You you one of the greatest heels now, bro. I took some time to reflect on the things I said to Damian Priest last week. Oh yeah, he offended mad people with the street trash. I ain't gonna lie, man. Listen, he he's still that guy, one of the best I see uh, title and holders. I agree. <laughs> Eyes clip. It's great. Oh, nah, they had enough. Let's skip that. I meant every word I said last week. <laughs> this right here is what's getting Damian Priest even more over. I know people don't have the full, the full belief in Damian Priest, but this right here got to be it. This right here is going to help Damian Priest get even more over, bro. Because what's at stake? Is what's nearest and dearest to Bring me. Bring general. And there is the reputation, the prestige, and the honor of this great sport and the world heavyweight championship. Whew. He cooking, boy. Ask, <laughs> yourself, ask yourself why he sent me out here first and not Damien Priest. Oh, yikes. You talking shit again. That is because everybody in this company and every single one of you know. He does not live up to it. Oh, damn. You a bum. And that cute little sob story about fighting from the streets and whatever. That does not hey, gang, we all from the hood, dog. Fight for the street. Really a real thing out here, yo. Oh, shit. That different. That man different. There's a saying where I come from. Zeig mir deine Freunde und ich zeig dir, wer du bist. I know that should sound like the Call of Duty uh, campaign dialogue. And I'll show you who you are. <laughs> so Damien, Daryl, you're going to have a field day with this one, bro. <laughs> and today is today where the judgment day will be judged by the Ring General. And the Ring General. Ring General. All of you collectively. <laughs> A street trash. Yo, Damien Priest, just come out, bruh. I know you've had enough of this already. Yo, come out, bruh. <clears throat> so, Damien Priest, I know you're back there. For the last time, I want to make you a generous offer. Come out here, lift the weight off your shoulders that you're not living up to carry. Yikes. And hand me I'm going to be honest with you as an IC title holder, he made that title more bigger um now because the last couple years before him it wasn't as big to me. So he really he really made that title like really prestigious. Okay, people want to see it. People want to see it. People want to see it now. Let's go. Oh, he had enough. He walking fast. Damn it. Okay, he had enough of your bullshit. That's what's really going on. He had enough of your bullshit, man. Yeah, Damien Priest, talk that shit, man. I just hope you get a new costume, dog. Your costume is that should be like tight in a different type of way. I right, yeah, do your thing, bro. Oh, you've had enough. You've had enough. Oh, shit. Yeah, come on, man. That's what I'm talking about. You ain't gonna lie, Priest. You could come out with that type of fit. We rocking with it. But the bisexual Undertaker fit. I ain't gonna lie, man. That shit give a different type of aura. That shit got me rooting on the side. <laughs> she got me rooting on the side, bro. This is what I like, bro. This right here is gonna get Priest over. Oh, shit. He did a huge um, big kick. 
Nah, yeah, nah. Priest had enough. Oh shit! Did they catch him? They catch him. They catch him. Yo, Priest had enough of your shit. Come on. Oh nah, this is great, bro. This is great, bro. Oh shit, this is great. I ain't gonna lie, man. Priest had enough. Oh, look at him in the background. Uh oh. Oh shit. <laughs> no. Oh shit. Oh damn. Oh damn. Oh damn. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Now you gotta keep these men from killing each other before. Oh, man. Now, this is great, bro. I ain't gonna lie. This, Priest needed this type of tension. There needed to be some sort of disrespect. They, they did it with Eddie Guerrero, bro, with Brock Lesnar. Like, it was necessary. There needed to be some sort of barrier broken that something personal was gonna be attacked. This is great. Oh, and I love when the GMs get involved. Too. Oh shit, Braun Breaker and Dragon Off. Oh, this is great. No shot, no shot. No way. Ah! Oh shit. Now Dragon Off is a great addition to WWE. I ain't gonna lie. This is great to the to the main roster. Oh shit! Yes, it is. I'm already knowing that they full fight was probably amazing. Karen that this full this full match right here was probably crazy. Oh shit! That's it. He just took it off. He took it off. Yo, uh, uh, Braun Breaker is absolutely over. It's ridiculous. They waited for him to get in. Oh wait, it's Dragon. That was devastating. Braun caught that clean. Daphne Lashaw, the official, out to check on Dragon off, and she's gonna wave this match off. Oh shit. Oh damn, Braun Breaker is a is a is a fucking animal. Oh, it's done. Ooh, concussion, concussion, or is this a work? Y'all let me know if y'all think this is a work. Is this a work or concussion? Ladies and gentlemen, Ilya Dragunov can no longer continue in this match. Okay. Therefore, your winner, Braun Is All right, so question if you make it this far into the video. Hold on, hold on. Question if y'all make it this far into the video. This I got to see as well. Was that a work? Because they don't really want Dragon off to lose, like, cause he they they want to find some way to fit him in a in a storyline. Is this a work where Braun Breaker's gonna get over? Obviously, he's already over enough. Um, and there's gonna be some superstars that they don't want to like risk them having losing streaks or just losing in general. So this was like this this concussion or whatever knocked out was just. Is that a, is that a work? Y'all let me know in the comment section. I don't know, cause technically, that's a good. If this was like a legit thing that he called a concussion, <clears throat> this would be a great way for him to just segue into like, yo, you just won out of TKO. I don't know. It's weird. It got to be at work. Like, absolutely. Ooh, I got to hear this. <clears throat> oh, shit. Punk had enough. Uh oh. Punk had enough of your shit. Injured at the Royal Rumble back in January by. Uh oh. He's taping up. Ready to throw haymakers with Drew McIntyre. He fully healed and everything. Oh, Drew really pulling up. Oh my God. Is Drew thinking the same? Oh, I ain't gonna lie. I don't see that bracelet on. He ain't get it back. And I ain't gonna hold you now that he's not injured no more. It's gonna be crazy. McIntyre has been obsessed uh -oh. with CM Punk since Punk arrived on the scene in WWE back in November. Oh man, look at this dude, bro. Look at this dude, it's over. 
CM Punk had enough, yo. And people been waiting to see him have a full flesh match too. Just some injuries suck. I can't tell you <clears throat> how long I've waited for this. All these times you've screwed me over. There's nothing in the world that's gonna stop me getting in that ring and tearing you apart. So are you not? <clears throat> so get in the ring, bitch. Except the fact that I don't want to. Oh my God, bro. You're such a fucking edge lord. <laughs> Well, I do. And Punk, Punk's getting after McIntyre. See him, Punk going after McIntyre. Get the fuck out. Come, out. come on, come on, Punk, relax. See him, Punk, Drew McIntyre's a lot. Come on now. Green Bay. That's a big money match. Oh, shit. He just disrespected him. This is title time. You got to learn to chill, control those emotions. Look at me. I'm chilled. I'm relaxed. When I'm emotional, I tend to, you know, turn to family and it just calms me right down. Oh shit, I ain't gonna lie, that's insane. <clears throat> that's insane, that's insane, that's insane. That's insane. That oh man, nah. Back 10 minutes, you just can't help yourself, punk. What he's not telling you. Hold on, calm down. Calm on, punk. Oh shit. What he's not telling you is there is a reason you're not fighting tonight. Wait, what? What? McIntyre is officially reinstated. CM Punk is officially medically cleared. Okay, so, so the fuck? It is official. CM Punk drew McIntyre at SummerSlam. I like this. CM Punk is that guy. Oh, shit. Oh, no. The Y6. It's her turn. Oh, my God. Now, nah, this one's creepy. <clears throat> now, nah, this one's creepy. I'm looking behind me and shit. This shit creepy. Look at yourself. They lied to you. They lied. Ignored you. Now, this is creepy. In solitude. This shit creepy as hell. Oh shit. Hell no. I'm good. That one is the probably the most creepiest so far. Come back to your coach. That was creepy. And rejoin this team. <clears throat> don't join, man. You don't need him, bro. Look at how fine ass. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. A little incentive before you answer. Don't forget. The Wyatt Six are after everybody on this roster, including you guys. So you join up with us, you get a little extra protection. Protection? Are you sure, Chad Gable? Like you protected the Creed brothers last week? Oh, oh shit. Yeah, when things get juicy and <clears throat> dangerous, Chad Gable flees the scene, gets out the ring, and leaves these two dead inside the ring. Oh, oh go ahead. Talk that shit. That's the kind of man you <clears throat> are. Talk that shit, Otis. And my answer is still no. Talk that shit, Otis. The oh shit. By Chad Gable. Oh, oh damn, I ain't gonna lie. Oh, they officially I said it's official. Oh shit. <clears throat> oh, it's all it's over. It's over. Hopefully they don't try to Oh shit. Oh, now nah, it's over. They're about to get spicy with their ass. It's literally clipped. That's it. Once you hear that shit, it's over. Nope. We good off that. Oh, shit. <clears throat>
Uh oh. Oh, they're pulling up. It's up. We need to see them in a match during SummerSlam. This is going to be great. Oh, shit. Uncle Howdy ain't here, though. Where the fuck is Bo Dallas? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, nah, this is amazing tribute. Oh, my. Oh, my God. That shit was so fucking lit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What a, an amazing tribute to his brother. Yeah, he sold that move perfect, too. Chad Gable really fucking sold it. Oh, my God. He sold that move perfect. Holy shit. Oh my God, that was perfect. Damn, I ain't gonna lie, that was perfect. Oh, Sheamus came back to get Pete Dunne. Oh shit. Ronson Reed, man, they, they need to do something special with him because he's nice, man. Just maybe change the outfit. That outfit's nasty. <clears throat> Yeah, get his ass, get him. Yikes, Jesus Christ. Ten bits of the battery. Sheamus said last week, I don't get it. Why did Oh shit, he grabbed it, he got it. He, ugh. Ugh, I ain't gonna lie, that shit's sweaty and nasty as a bitch. I ain't gonna lie. Ugh. Bronson Reed's gonna spear him. Bronson Reed's gonna spear him. Oh shit, I thought he was gonna get him right there. Maybe not. He called Bronson Reed. He called Bronson Reed, I ain't gonna lie. He clipped Bronson Reed with that one. So I'm one, yo, I mean, yo, look, listen, SummerSlam is literally August 3rd. Make sure y'all pull up to the Discord, because that's gonna be nuts as well. Holy shit, it's clipped. Hell no, I ain't trying to get clipped with this music either. Fuck this. Shout out to YouTube. Three oh. Little words. <clears throat> what the fuck going on? There's no way he would ever choose like live over over uh over Rhea. Rhea fire, bro. I hate you, Liv. Are you stupid? Are you deaf? No entiendes lo que te estoy diciendo, cabrona. I don't like you. You've ruined my life over and over again. No te puedo entender lo que piensas por la cabeza. Estás pendeja, ¿o qué? I can't. Oh shit. You. You've ruined everything for me. And now I Te odio con toda mi vida. Oh shit, he's selling this. He's selling this. She's about to cry? Is she really crying? And your live is fuck. <laughs> Live look good as hell. Damn. Yep. She just licked him. Yeah, she did. I ain't gonna lie. He somehow I'm gonna tell you the truth. And he look like Eddie right there. I ain't gonna he look like Eddie. <laughs> That motherfucker look like Eddie. Yo, that fucking stupid. He look like Eddie, bro. He look like Eddie a lot. Yo, that's insane. He looks like Eddie. That's insane. I ain't gonna lie. He look like Eddie. Wow. That's insane, bro. That motherfucker lucky, I ain't gonna lie, real fire. Lick my face, bitch. Sorry. Okay, Finn. Makes the tag. Oh shit. Who 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 uh J partnering with? Yeah, 
Ooh, shit. That looked, that looked, that looked like he sold that shit well. Ooh, that was a sell. That super kick was a good sell. See, that one was a good sell. That was a good sell. Well, who's his partner? Damn, that one was so he sold that shit. Oh, it's with Sami Zayn. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh shit. Then Balor decides to kick him out of the ring. Balor calls for a double team now. Place the Uso up on the top. Uh oh. You're going to have to. Oh my God. Sammy Zayn going to need everybody there. Balor trying to. Oh shit. Throw his ass out. There it goes. Headbutt by Jay. Kaluma kick. Woo. Oh shit! W cell. Oh shit! W W W. That was a W. Okay, that was a little W segment right there. Okay. It, they, they, you know what? They got a good history too. When you, you know, that relationship they had in the bloodline. Um, I think, I think as a tag team, they could do something. They could do something. But Jay by himself, I'm still not completely sold that. Like he got like heavyweight potential. Oh hell! I ain't gonna lie, he, he went crazy right there. Uh oh, oh my god, that was nuts! Holy shit! Yeah, there was some other like highlights and stuff like that that probably weren't like as important, but I heard Raw was really good today. And as I watched, that shit was amazing. So make sure you guys comment, subscribe. Let me know what y'all looking forward to on Friday. And are you guys excited for August third? I cannot wait. Uh, the week just started. There's gonna be a lot going on. I think it's like in a week and a half or so. But um, again, hit the socials in the link in the description. What's your thoughts? Braun Breaker is one of my one of my favorites right now that came from NXT. Dragonoff is another elite that uh, just came from NXT. How do you feel about Carmelo Hayes, um, his current shine and where he fits in with the current roster at Raw or SmackDown? What do y'all see in the future for him? But um, until then, it's your boy 3 I'm out of here. God bless. Peace out, y'all.